What's up crew? I'm going to show you today how to clean your AC if your AC is not cooling right. You don't even need to call an AC repairman. You know, AC repairman is going to charge you three, four hundred bucks. You can do this for a lot less and you can do it on your own. It's simple. It's really easy. So I'm going to show you through. I'm going to show you what you need. You need this Craftsman pressure washer. You need a battery. You can use a five hour or you can use a smaller one too. You can use a two hour. I like using this five hour they just seem to have a little bit more power and uh, they last longer with the pressure washer you get all these you get this equipment here this is your bottle to mix your cleaning chemicals in it and then you will need the cleaning chemical the thing you need is pro coil cleaner all of these products right here they will be linked in the bottom of this video you'll see them across the bottom you can click on and buy any of them this a little bit of pricier but and the psi is not you're not going to like clean your pressure wash your house or what but this is perfect for like washing your car washing your boat uh, cleaning your ac coals washing small things ice chest other stuff it's not like a full-blown pressure washer but this thing will do the job for what we're fixing to do it's actually ideal and perfect because it's easy lightweight and you can carry it with you and then you can mix the chemicals directly into here and then run it through your pressure washer so it's like ideal for cleaning your AC system so the battery goes in here on the craftsman tool it keeps it from getting wet slap that in there First thing you gotta do is kill your power to your AC unit. You do that right here with this breaker. Hopefully there's no wasp in there. Once you get this open, you just pull this breaker right here. And that'll kill the power. Make sure you put this right here. You don't want to lose that. Once you kill the power, all you gotta do is around the top of this, this cowling, there's a bunch of screws, and you pop all the screws off all the way around the top. The top of this thing will pop off. Once you get the top loose, these things here, button down here, push it, pop up like that and then slide up move these over out of the way as you can see covered in dust and debris and all this is stopping the AC from getting its maximum cool and it is completely gunked up so the next thing you're gonna need is a vacuum and we recommend this one it's portable and easy to use I want to show you the before watch this if I just run my finger lightly over these coils here you can see the amount of dust and debris and all that is keeping your AC from getting cool <laughs> if you got caked on stuff you really need to take either a light brush or you can peel this off with your hand if it's thick and coated like this but all this is basically running up your electric bill making your AC work twice as hard and in summertime especially here in Louisiana this right here is gonna cost this is costing me probably an extra hundred two hundred bucks a month chemical on there probably gonna treat this one twice because it was so bad now we're gonna come back with a high pressure why well, this craftsman is perfect for the job it's because it only does 350 psi so you're not going to damage your coil if you had a stronger pressure washer you'd mess up your coil And then basically you just do everything back in reverse and put it back together. So by doing myself, I have two AC units. The total savings was somewhere around $500 that the AC guy would have charged us to come out and do this. We did it ourselves. We, we classified this as a three beer job. It was not that difficult. Uh, pretty much anybody can work a screwdriver and a pressure washer. You can do it. I highly recommend getting the, the Craftsman tools in the video. They really made the job easy to do. This is a job that anybody can do. And like I said in the video, the Craftsman pressure washer is ideal for this job because the PSI is low and you can't really damage your coil. 
wheels and it will get in all the little nooks and crannies. Our house is way more comfortable. We would cook and when we would cook at kitchen we heat up. This unit services our kitchen and now that we've done this service it is way cooler and way more comfortable inside. If you enjoyed this how to video make sure you go visit us at www.fulllifecrew.com forward slash blog and we have tons of other money saving tips and ideas on our blog. Thank you for watching.